Hey everyone, my name is Hydro and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to convert your Microsoft family account into a normal account. Now this video has been highly requested and so without wasting any of your time, uh, let's just begin by firstly clicking on the link in the description down below. And once you do that, you'll be taken to this page and basically all you have to do is check if you're an organizer or a member, all right? And so firstly, if you're an organizer, basically you can directly go ahead and leave family group. And if you're here because of the privacy settings, you can also go ahead and change your uh, privacy settings, not only for yourself, but also the other members that are in your family account by clicking on manage my family's Xbox online settings. And now it's going to open up this new tab and you'll have to type in your password if you haven't already done that before. Okay, click on no thanks. All right. So over here, as you guys can see, so you can not only change for yourself, but you can also change for other members. So as you guys can see, so Hydroform 12 is another member, is a normal member and I'm the organizer. I mean, so as you guys can see, then you can directly go ahead and click on allow and everything you want and go ahead and click on submit, not only for your own account, but also for your members. So other members who are there on your this thing, on your family account, you can also do that. And now if you're just a member and not an organizer, what you have to do is, and basically all you have to do is follow the same steps exactly. Just go ahead and click on the link in the description. It doesn't matter. And now you'll be in this page and you can go ahead and leave family group. However, I forgot to mention one thing. If you're an organizer, so say you're an organizer, you cannot leave the family group if any one of the member is under 18. So if their Microsoft age is under 18 year old, if the Microsoft age set is under 18 year old, you cannot leave because there is a child in the family group and hence you cannot leave for whatever reason. I'm not sure you can ask Microsoft that anyway. So that's just if you're an organizer. So again, if you're a member, you can just go ahead and click on leave family group. And then are you sure you want to remove yourself? Go ahead and click on that and boom, you'll be left from the family group. And yeah, yeah. And then you can go ahead and create your own family group, but do not do that if you want privacy settings. Actually, if you want privacy settings, you can do that if you're the organizer, which is basically the creator of the group. And yeah, guys, so this is basically how you do it. I know it's be, it's a highly requested video. And so I thought I would do it for you guys. And with that, we have come to a conclusion. So if you guys found this video useful, make sure to smash that like button, share it with other people who might find this useful as well. And also leave a like for the YouTube algorithm and subscribe if you haven't already done that. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Now, see ya.